So determine the measure of the missing angle, round all answers to the nearest degree. Okay, so um, in part A, my reference angle is going to be X because that's what I'm looking for. Eight is opposite and then 10 is the adjacent. Don't label the hypotenuse because I'm not given the hypotenuse, so it's useless to me at this point. So just label the two that you're given. All right, so O and A, that's tangent. So you're gonna go tan. Now right next to your trig function normally goes the angle, but we don't know what it is. So you're gonna just have to sub the X in. Equals, now you're gonna write your ratio. So for tangents, O, divided by a, so eight over 10. To get the x by itself, this is where you inverse both sides with tan. So you'll tan inverse both sides. So tan inverse of eight tenths. And you're gonna type it into the calculator exactly as I've written it with the brackets. On the graphing calculator, um, the left bracket should automatically open up. Okay, so calculator's out. So you're going to hit the second function, tan, and then 8 divided by 10. The fraction button is just the division sign. And we're going nearest degree, so you get 39 degrees. Okay, part B. You're going to label the two given sides with x as the reference angle. So the 20 will be the adjacent. 30 will be the hypotenuse. A and H, which one? Cosine. So cos X, remember the angle goes right next to the uh, trig function. Watch your notation here, guys. You, the setup has to be basically the way I've written it, okay? Don't try to do any new creative way of rewriting the equations. This is the standard way that you'll want to write them. Okay, so it'll be adjacent over hypotenuse, so 20 over 30. So x is equal to cos inverse of 20 over 30. Okay, into the calculator that goes. Get 48 degrees. All right, I suggest at this point that you pause the video and try part C on your own and then um, restart the video up again and I'll go through how to do it and then you can just check your answers. Okay, so hopefully you were able to complete uh, part C on your own. Let's go through it together now. So X, reference angle, two is your opposite, five is your hypotenuse. Okay, so O and H, that's sine. So sine X is equal to opposite over hypotenuse, so two over five. So x is equal to sine inverse, two fifths. Okay, so you're gonna plop that into your calculator. You get 24 degrees.